Do you want to explain what we're doing today? <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Smith? Well, according to the Watchtower's website, they boast, basically, about placing over 20 billion pieces of Bible-based literature in households around the world. So what we're doing is handing out literature of our own. In fact, this literature is going to be available on the Here Lies the Truth website for everyone else to download and print and hand out to Jehovah's Witnesses should they, uh, they visit your house. So Fantastic. That's where we are. Want to take a sneak peek at it? Sure. Yeah. Hold on. Here's the official Truth Be Told poster. And here are a couple of flyers that we have. And we're just going to hand out to everyone. Is it, sir? Mine, uh... No, thank you. You sure? No, thank you? That's interesting because <laughs> that's the classic response that most people have to witnesses is no thank you. I, I think. Or beat it. Fuck out of here. I don't know. Uh, oh, whoa, he's avoiding us. What happened? Nice dodge. Well, I mean, Sorry, I was right? talking to some witnesses yesterday. They said that, uh, you know, we should be open minded. Who, we should be open minded? Yeah, you know, they were telling me how, you know, they just want to have conversations and. Oh, as do I. Take their literature. Yeah, oh, these, they're already alternating, so oh, I guess. Kinda, so that one says, right which what is, what is this one about? If you do not serve Jehovah, you will die. Nice. Just sorry about the weather. I mean, I had no control over it. That's all right. Man. It's all right. And this one is, do you know the truth? Um, talks a little about the movie and has a little testimonial from someone who um, well, escaped the religion and saying how they are living free for the first time and teaching their children to do the same. It's curious again to see the witness response to accepting literature. I mean, we are in these two panic shots, showing exactly where we are. We are in J-Dub Central. You can see the Watchtower building in the distance over there, which we'll make our ways over there in a little bit. And not for nothing, I get the feeling that there are a lot of Bethelites that are on the fence that really do want to do leave the organization. But... Again, the repercussions of leaving, uh, the blowback is just just too dire, the consequences, and that keeps them in. But I, I really think that I wonder if there's some that are in the inside doing uh, subversive type of activities, whether it's deliberately creating illustrations that... Remember, did you see the one with the... There was a guy chasing a goat. Right. Uh, and he just had a really funny expression on his face. I get the feeling that that's... An artist within Bethel, <laughs> you know, just trying to take down the Watchtower and the very, as I said, subversive and indirect way. Thank you. This is excellent. A lot of them take the train over here. Actually, there's a train, the stop, right behind. Yeah. Yeah. But well, I mean, hey, this is a great me, spot. Let me get the camera for a second because, right. like, we have Ruben who's giving us local intel. <laughs> in terms of the JW travel patterns, you know, so <laughs> well, apparently a train station around the corner, a train station around the corner, yeah, right over here. Yeah, that's well, a lot street. of witnesses they do their witnessing or street work right near a train station, exactly. so that might be a good idea. You know where they're, you're there. If I mean, you know, it would be a great spot. They're all over 34th Street and 42nd Street with their stands. Oh, sure, sure. I and mean, if we went down and try to show people that we're handing that to them and see yeah. if they take ours, because yeah. they're expecting people to take yeah. theirs. Yeah, and today today's a test run just to see what it's like. Right. You know, I haven't done field service in years. <laughs> you know, so these guys have never done field service. Who are these guys, anyway? Oh, yeah, who are you guys? Well, here's Greg O'Connor, assistant producer. Of uh, truth be told, and and a friend. Yeah, I'm just just a volunteer. <laughs> oh, cool! cool. Thank you, 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 you Thomas. You know anything about the witnesses? No, nah, just a little bit, but not not much actually. Um, yeah, where are you from? Chile. Chile? Yeah. Okay. Chile, yeah. No. You have the witnesses in Chile? We do actually. Yeah, the uh, Stigos de Ova. Yeah. I don't yeah. think they're as so strong as here, but yeah, it's, 
Yeah, we do. Like, I think they're everywhere. So. Oh, there's, yeah. there's a group yeah. coming right, right now. Here's a group. I'm going to hand the camera back to Ruben. All right. You know what? Let's find out with the white boy. You guys. <laughs> <laughs> I might look a little menacing in my Watchmen t-shirt <laughs> and shades. And, uh, <laughs>